hi welcome back to the channel on today's video i am making a cheesy vegetable soup repurposing leftovers from the fridge this super this soup is super fast and easy comes together with what you have laying around so if you're interested come on over to the kitchen okay i opened up the refrigerator and i have a container of leftover vegetables right there. Doesn't that look lovely? It's bell peppers, onions, zucchini, broccoli. So I'm going to put that in this pan. A little bit of butter. Get that heated up. Rinse that out with some warm water. I found this open package of cheddar cheese powder, so I'm just going to throw that in there. I think I'm going to make a cheesy vegetable soup. It's kind of chilly today and rainy, so that should work. Make a mess on my stove. Mix that in there. And then I'll top this off with some water and it should be ready. Soup is one of those things that I really love to make in the wintertime. It's fast, it's easy, it's warm, it's comforting, and it comes together fairly easy with the ingredients that you have on hand. Bring that up to a simmer, and then I will hit it with the immersion blender, and then we'll have a creamy, cheesy vegetable soup. I probably should taste it for seasoning. Everything was already seasoned from being pre-cooked, so I think that will work just fine. When you're blending this up, you can uh, check it for consistency. If it's as thick as you like it, then you're fine. If you think it needs to be a little thicker, just make a slurry with some flour and milk or water and stir it in there until you get the thickness that you want with your soup. It's coming up to a boil, and I have just this little bit of egg noodles left in the pantry. So I'm going to add that to it. It's very foamy, but that'll settle down once I take it off the heat. Okay, I'm going to turn that down to low. And uh, let it do its thing, and then we'll have lunch. And that's it. Easy, creamy vegetable soup in under 30 minutes. Thanks for watching the video. I appreciate all you guys watching and sharing and liking and subscribing. It really helps the channel out a lot. I will be working on some more videos as soon as my elbow heals. And until then, I'll see you on the next one. Bye.